Hey, what's up everybody? How you guys doing? So really quick in this video, I'm going to be showing you what I use to root the LG G Stylo for Boost Mobile. So yeah, not even uh, 24 hours and the phone is rooted. So just that's just letting you guys know that this phone is rootable and it's very easy to do. So I'm going to show you guys uh, where I got the stuff and uh, just basically how it works. But to let you guys know, you're going to need a laptop, PC, or a MacBook, whichever you, you have. You're going to need to download LG um, drivers. Yeah, <laughs> the LG drivers. Um, but yeah, anyways, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so I do apologize for the shakiness because I'm going to hold the camera with my hands instead of my tripod, but I'm just going to show you guys uh, exactly where I went to get it. Um, obviously, you see down here, that is one thing you're going to need if I can get it to show without it being all fuzzy. But it's called the LG One Click Root uh, Program. You can get that. There's also, um, this is the 1.3 version. Which didn't work for me. The the 1.2 version did. I'll show you. I'll demo that one here in this video. But um, link in the description of where to get all the stuff. Let me just pop the website so you guys can see what you're going to be looking for. There was uh, a few things that um, needed to be done. I installed the uh, LG drivers, and uh, I had a bit of problem with that, uh, just because the um, the phone still couldn't couldn't uh, be be read, so um, there's a manual mode, and I will talk about that a little bit later. That you have to do to to get the program to actually root the phone. So, uh, let's see. So, anyways, um, while we wait for the site to load, this is basically the website right here, smartphoneclinics.com. Easiest root LG Stylo LS seven seven zero one click root method. Uh, this is the website you're going to go to, and it's got a bunch of ads, so, but uh, let's scroll down and I will show you guys some things that you will need. So as you guys see right here, these are the things that you're going to need. So yeah, you're going to need uh, the drivers. Um, the top one over here, that is the LG One Click Root 1.2. This one is a 1.3, obviously. Uh, 1.2 worked for me, then 1.3 did. And I'll explain here in a second. But anyways, yeah, so you're going to download drivers. You're going to download either the 1.2 or 1.3. And that's really all you need. Uh, once you download drivers, install them onto your PC. Okay, so now from here, um, once you install drivers, we're going to use... Uh, the uh, LG root script version 1.2 open that up and down here you're gonna see this one LG root script dot BAT so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to take your device and you're gonna want to basically connect it via USB okay so let me go and do that right now even though my phone's already rooted I'll still do it again so hang on just a second Okay, so now that I have that, um, we're going to click the LG root script. I don't know if it registered that, so let's double click it. And we'll click run. And it'll start to look like this. We'll say starting ADB servers, device detected, pushing files. And it's going to say rebooting, looking for LG serial port. Now, sometimes it does not read. And then it will tell you to do a manual uh, boot. And what that is, is it's uh, putting the phone in download mode. And it's real easy to do. So when you reach this point where it says rebooting, and then it says uh, LG Silver Port, wait 
until it tells you to do a manual uh, boot into download mode, which is, so, which is super, super easy, but you're going to want to get it done as soon as it tells you that, because if you wait any longer, it'll just hang. So, you, you know, if you have to boot it in download mode, basically just, um, you know, disconnect the USB, pop the battery out, pop the battery back in, and while the phone is off, hold the volume up button and connect the USB port. And that will, will boot it into download mode. Once it's in download mode, it's going to hang for about another two minutes. See, as you see right here, it says disconnect cable. Well, let me get close so you guys can see that. But it's telling me to put it in, in download mode, which is real, like I said, it's real easy. All you got to do is uh, disconnect your phone from the USB cable, power it off, and then once it's fully powered off, hold the, the volume up button, which is located in the back closest to the camera. Hold the volume up button. Do not press the power button. Just hold down the volume but the volume up button and connect the USB cable. And then once it's in download mode, it's going to hang for about a minute or two. And then it'll finish uh, pushing the necessary files for root. Once it's done, it's going to have an option that says to hit um, control N. And that will reboot your phone. And that's pretty much it. You will have root. And of course, wait, let me unlock my device. Now I'll show you guys that I do have root. So besides just showing you guys, you know, the usual Super SU, which I can open. And it shows apps that I have there like SD Made or even Greenify. Now I know you can use Greenify and SD Made without root, but uh, when you use Greenify, basically it opens up apps and has you basically force close every app manually. Whereas this one, uh, no nap, no apps need hibernating. Let's see, what would... Uh... Hmm. We'll use uh, SD Made Pro because when you have root, you can actually... Um... There it goes, granted super user permissions. So there you go. Shows that I have root on my LG G Stylo, also the LS770. So anyways, that's it, guys. Uh, hopefully this works for you guys. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Leave a comment. I'll try to get to them as soon as I can. And um, that's uh, pretty much it. Link in the description for downloads. And if you guys did enjoy this, let me know by leaving me that thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. And share this video with all your friends on Google+, Facebook, and Twitter. My name's Tito. I'm signing out. Stay blessed.